the prophet Jose spoke these words. My people are destroyed for the lack of the knowledge of God. And still today, these words ring true. Introducing W.C. Hunter, pastor of the World Church of the Living God in Chattanooga, Tennessee. For the next half hour, we invite you to experience the words of Knowledge Broadcast. All right, now I'm going to talk to you today Amen. to very important, important principles. We're going to talk about your life here on earth. God has made the preparation for your eternal life. Wherever he's going to be, I'm going to prepare a place. Now, we can't jump up and, as some of these guys and be talking about going help and this and that and all Jesus said, I go to prepare a place for you. I'm coming back and I'm going to receive into my own. The rapture, the catching away, those who have the spirit of God in them. If they don't have the spirit of God in them, they ain't going. They'll be right here on this earth and receive the mark of the beast or the antichrist. They'll be right here to go through all the tribulation and mess and stuff and then end up in hell. So we stick to the promise that God's co Jesus is coming back. He's going to appear. Like he said, he's coming back. Yes, and the spirit of the Lord that's in you now, with the spirit of God connecting, is going to draw you up. Yes, sir. Yes, and wherever the place is, what he prepared. Where he, wherever he prepared. I'm going to do what? Prepare. Prepare. So I don't know where it's at. Amen. What? Well, you know we're going to go to heaven. I mean, well, well, wherever Jesus said, if it's in hell, it's heaven. <laughs> you understand that? So I don't know where this place he's going to prepare. But we're going to see it. We're going to see him like it is, okay? Now, let's deal with the earth here, down here, where we're supposed to be. We're not an angelical being. Now, you know the difference, but I want you to get this stuff. I'm not going to be, I'm going to just go and take my time. You got to know the difference from an angelical being and an earthly being. We're earthly beings. We're made out of the earth, the ground, the dirt, the dust. And every mineral and chemicals or whatever they're in the earth just about. Got it? Heavenly beings, angelical beings, even Satan and all his angelical beings are created. They're not made out of no dust. They're, not, they're created beings that God created. You get it? Yes, and creation by his spoken word. Yes, sir. Get it? The earth, the heavens, or divinely for angelical beings, beings that can ascend yes, by thought yes, and come through space in a moment. Yes, sir. You can't jump through no space in a moment. The science use technology to try to go on the moon different stuff. But an angels can ascend, descend, yes, like lightning. Yes, the angelical beings come through all, and when they come through, they come through the dominion of the devil, which is darkness. Yes, prince of darkness. Yes, He's the prince of the air. Yes, sir. Yes. <laughs> Get it? Yes, so when the, the angels and blessings had to come through these darkness and these angelical beings and, and stuff that, that you don't see, they don't see, you can't see. I mean, they see each other, but you can't see them. You see them, it'll blow your mind. That's <laughs> what people have to go crazy to, to see this stuff that's unknown. You get it? So there's a difference. We got an earthly, a earthly ministry toward one another. Yes, sir. Not, not minister to angels. Yes. Angels are the ministering spirit. Yes, sir. They minister us yes. to the man of God and he ministered. Yes, sir. God got it set up the way he got it set up. Amen. And nobody going to change. don't care what they think or what they're talking about. I want you to get, I want, God is designed for you to be blessed. To prosper. Yes, sir. Don't let nobody tell you he don't want you to prosper. But I'm going to tell you why people don't. Yes, 
I'm going to give you some information about prosperity, wealth, and health. I'm going to give it. Talk about earth. Whatever God got in heaven, that's his business. Do you understand that? Yeah. He's got all of that covered. I don't have to be. You know, all I have to do is stay communicated. Oh, yes, sir. Just stay communicated. Yes, sir. And that's through word and thought. Yes, sir. Word and thought. Where you want? Where you want to go? Then he'll direct me. I already got it written what I want. Yes, you get it? You follow that. And I'll be with you. I'll back it. And if any, if any of you think that God don't back what he say, you just off track, period. You just, you messed up. And there's so many people today, and I don't want you sitting under my ministry today, and in this place today, in this building today, and be messed up. And get your life messed up, and you'll find it and everything messed up. I don't want it. I've seen too much in 40 years. You think I ain't seen nothing in 40-something years? I believe God gave me the wisdom that I need to know. Yes, what is wisdom? Is to know the different. Yes, to know the different. And don't think I don't know the difference. I know who's friends. I know who's not. I know who's a leech. And I know who's people. And there's two types of people in the world. Understand this. And two types. Leeches. Who want what you got. And they're people that are, has wisdom who want what you know. Do you understand that? The, no, you got to know the difference, who they are. You got to know who they are and have the wisdom, know how to treat them, know how to do it, how to do it. You got to know this stuff. Yes, wisdom is the principal thing on the earth. On the earth. It's principle. He didn't say the Holy Spirit didn't say God, he didn't say nothing. Wisdom is the principal thing. Let me read it to you. I want you to go to, Pro go to Proverbs. I, I teach you only this, and I won't keep, I'm going to keep on until you get it. And when you get it, then you got something going for you. In other words, you ain't. If you don't get it, you ain't got nothing going for you. Proverbs, the fourth chapter, seven verse. But I'm going to give you a scripture. I'm going to read here, and then I'm going to go on into what, what you need to know. And listen what it say. Carefully. Carefully. It's what God said. It's what God's word tells you. And it means it. God cannot lie. He's not going to lie. He cannot. It's impossible for him to lie. He won't lie. And what he say, he mean it. But you have to get the revelation. Because it's hidden. Get the mystery. Get, get ready for the, what they read and understand. The mystery of God is hidden. This book here, everybody can't get this and start reading and try to tell somebody something. Yet, though it say this, but it don't mean that. What? I thought everything the word of God say me. Well, you think anything you want to do. This, gotta, this here has to be given. And by God's choice. Amen. Who read, brother? Proverbs 4, 7. Wisdom. Wisdom is. Don't miss this. Not might be. Wisdom is. The principal thing. That's all I need. Wisdom is what? The principal thing. Is that all that in that one? Yes, sir. That's it? Okay. Yes, sir. Nothing else. Amen. Well, what is wisdom? Get this straight. If you don't get this straight, you ain't getting nothing straight. You got to get this straight. Everybody got a Bible? Yes. Take and hold it up. Wisdom of God is the principal thing. Yes, sir. This book you got in your hand, which is the holy word of God, is the wisdom of God. Nothing else. This is it. Yes, sir. It's the wisdom of God. Yes, sir. That's why I didn't say, that's why I say wisdom is a principal thing. It didn't say God is a principal thing and nobody else is. Yes, 
So if you don't know what the wisdom of God is, this is the wisdom of God. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. There's no wisdom greater than this wisdom. Amen. It's wisdom about marriage. It's wisdom about finances. It's wisdom about wealth. Good health. Relationships. It's the wisdom of all of this. Everything. Do, do you get what I said? Who know the principal thing? Okay, it's good. I just want you to get that. Now, if you don't get that, you can't. You might as well forget. And I don't care what kind of strategy. And some folk can think they can strategize God. <laughs> Is that the way we yes, strategize? Yes, they sir. can't do nothing. They die like a fool, broke, miserable, and everything, and leave everything messed up. Everything that they started and messed up. Ain't going nowhere. Because they reject authority. If you get what I tell you today, I make a promise according to God's word. You will prosper. You will be in health. You have a power. And you have authority because you respect it. What you don't respect, you're not going to get it. Period. I don't care how much you hustle, bustle, Steal, cheat, beat, do whatever you want to do. It's going to fail you. Hear it. It's going to fail you. I don't care what you do. Work 20 jobs. You can steal $20 million. You can do anything you want to do. It ain't going to work. It's going to go down the drain. If it's not respect and honor. Did I get that? Ready? Read it. This book of First Corinthians, second chapter, starting with the fifteenth verse. Fifteenth verse. We'll get this real quick. Okay. Okay, go ahead. But he that is spiritual. He he that is spiritual. Judgeth. All things. He judge all things. He that is spiritual, who made him spiritual? God. I got authority placed in the right place. Police department, fire department, everything is placed in its right place to protect the people and to do what's necessary for me on the earth. Get that clear, okay? Got school teachers, got all this. Do, do, do y'all are y'all getting that? Yes, sir. Got doctors, nurses, lawyers, and all this. Some crooked, some crooked, some ain't, some, you understand that? But there's some people God put there who cares. Yes, Do y'all understand that? Yes, sir. In every department yes, sir. of authorities of the world, government, you got to understand this here, the separation. Yes, sir. And the communication comes from God by the Spirit. Yes, sir. Light in action. Yes. Light in action. Angel get through to you. And sometimes they get interrupted with the spirit of devil or the darkness. Like Daniel took him 20 some days to get his prayers answered. I think it was 20, 20, 20 21. 21 days. And the angel got there. So, man, I heard God heard you when this person prayed. But I was interrupted. And I had to call on the mightier angel of Michael to come and help me out. Yes, to get through to you. Yes, See all that going on. You don't know nothing about it. <laughs> Go ahead. Read. Yet he himself. He, he that is spiritual. Yes sir. What? But he that is spiritual judgeth all things. Yet he himself is judged of no man. No man. Amen. Get that clear. Get that clear. For who hath known the mind of the Lord? Who have known the mind of the Lord? Who? Well, tell you who. Go ahead. That he may instruct him. That God may instruct him. 
But we have the but mind have of Christ. Mind of Christ. Yes, sir. That's authority. Yes, sir. Get it? Second. Yeah. Second, second chapter. Go, second chapter. Go ahead. Let's get that and then I'm going on to talk to you. And our brethren, when I came to you. When I come to you, brethren. This ain't talking about the world. This is not talking about just anybody. Who is it talking about? The brethren, the saints. Saints. Chosen of God. Call of God. Brethren. Sisters. Go ahead. And I, brother, and I brother, man of God. Brethren, uh -huh. when I came to you. When I came to you. Came not with excellency of speech. I, I didn't come with excellence of speech. Yes, Among you, tell you what's what. Straight out where you'll understand it. Yes, sir. And the mysteries come out to you. Yes, that others don't hear. When you walk in the mystery, they think you crazy. Yes, but those are organized by God. Led by God. Chosen by God as brothers and sisters in the Lord. In obedience. And God, and understand that the grace of God is the most powerful thing. Amen. The knowledge, wisdom, Amen. is in the grace of God. Amen. And God operates, he operates in a system that is a rewarding system. What does that mean? Yes, what do y'all tell me quickly? Given to the people, it's a system of cause and effect. Good, so if you operate in the good causes of God, the instruction of God, you get the you can't effect, lose. you get the reward. You, you can't lose. Amen. And realize it at the beginning, that's all by grace. Thank God that I'm able yes, sir. Yes, sir. to obey and to walk in your way. Yes, and you read your Bible out of 8,000 words, all them words in the Bible, and you see if, 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 if you will, if, if you get tired of if <laughs> all through it yes, sir. got all them words if you will if a rewarding system yes, sir. understand it's my grace and love toward you that I'm doing this but you have a responsibility I tell you how to do it. You got a money system. You got a, you got a banking system. <laughs> Wealth system. Yes, sir. Go yes, ahead. Sir. Or of wisdom declaring unto you the testimony of God. What kind of wisdom is he talking about? Wisdom. We're supposed to have wisdom. Yes, sir. Wisdom. Well, what kind is he talking about? He, I didn't come with the wisdom. The wisdom of the world. He's talking about the world's wisdom. Yes, the world has and taken the wisdom of God, have taken wisdom and have used it for their benefit. Yes, sir. I told you it's two kingdoms. Yes. Kingdom of this world. The kingdom of this world is what killed Jesus. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Period. And his leader is Satan. His kingdom is a kingdom of darkness. And what do darkness mean? Well, you missed quickly. Darkness is that kingdom that's ruled by the dark power of Satan himself. Principality, sin, anti-God. It's against the ways of God. It's a kingdom set up opposite the operation of the system of God. That simple. That's why your persecution came. That's why your persecution come to you. And you wonder what's going on. But well, once you know what's happening, you can pre be prepared and, and, and go on and still be successful and do what you got to do. Yes, sir. But if you want it and you're thinking God doesn't turn on and this and that and all. <laughs> and you cannot play with the world. No, sir. No, sir. You can't do it. It won't work. Man. What do darkness have to do with light? Resist yes. and oppose yes, any evil. 
I'm not saying you're going to do it all the time, but hey, this is your primary reason for being here. Go ahead. For I determined not to know anything among you save Jesus Christ and him crucified. That's the power of God. And I was with you in weakness and in fear and in much trembling. That means when you're going through your stuff, ain't nobody hardly in here that went through stuff that I haven't been with them. Amen. Yes, sir. Amen. And, and they come to me for advice to get away through. The spoken word. And some of you have heard and heed the word and got it together. You messed it up and got it, but you got it together in obedience. You brought it back together. And some ain't heard nothing. They still going their way, do what they want to do. And my speech and my preaching was not with enticing words. I didn't have to use no enticing words on you. Of man's wisdom. And who's wisdom? Man's wisdom. Who? Man's wisdom. This is strategy. <laughs> so many of y'all been manipulated by strategies. Period. Some of you wives have been manipulated by strategies of your old man. But in demonstration of the spirit and of power. You get demonstration. What does demonstration mean? You see the action. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. You see the power flowing. Yes, sir. You see what the spoken word can do. Change your life. Brought you back together when you're broken up. Wisdom know the difference. If you gather this wisdom, you know the difference. You know the different in timing. You know the different in people. You you know the different, and you don't have to run behind them. You just the spirit. You know the different of disobedient or rebellion. You know the different. God will give you the power to rid that. Which will bring you harm later, or bring you harm, or destroy you. And you have the wisdom to know how to read it. God give you wisdom to know how to keep a hold to that which is good for you and will bring goodness to you. Although right at the present it might not be too cool, but hey, get with it. If God leads you and you have the wisdom, so no, this is good for me. I can't. People that throw away good things, they didn't know it. Because they didn't have the wisdom. Yes, <laughs> then they heard all their life. And it caused a lot of problems. Yes. It's called jealousy, envy, hatred. It's, just, it's crazy. When you get out of order, it, God is an order of God. Yes, when you get out of order, you're going to mess up everything. Get out of order. That your faith should not stand in the wisdom of men. So, so your faith, I don't want it to stand in the wisdom of man. Amen. And the cunning, craftiness, slickness. Amen. I want your faith to walk in God, to trust God, to have the ability to know what to receive and what to turn loose and what to keep and what to put aside, what to put behind you, what to put in front of you. You, you got that wisdom. That's what I want to see. If you don't like it, then you do whatever you want to do. Go ahead. But in the power of God. And, uh, and what? Won't you to walk in what? In the power of God. That's authority. Yes, sir. Uh -huh. Yes, sir. <laughs> yeah. that, that's authority. Yes, sir. That's what I want you to walk in. Yes, sir. Not the ideals and the craftings of me. This is what it says. Go ahead. Let, read. Read that. We'll go. Six verse. Howbeit we speak wisdom among them that are perfect. Uh, see? <laughs> Yet not the wisdom of this world. See, I keep saying world and God's king. 
Now you can see a little better, can't you? That's a different, right? Yes, sir. World. Now you know what world means, don't you? Nor do that. Do that mean the, 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 the oceans and enjoying the catching fish and traveling and enjoying vacation, all that? That ain't the world. That's the world we live in that God made for everybody. The world means a system. Yes, sir. It's a system. Yes, sir. That's what we, a system of how things do and how things are being manipulated and moved and done. That's what the world means. It don't mean you can't go fishing or enjoy the, the beauty of the land and the beauty that God has put in. You're supposed to. Amen. And feel sorry of you who don't have the wisdom to do so. Amen. Enjoy it. The vacation, enjoy getting away and getting in a quiet place and, and, and having some fun and enjoying the hum, human gift that God has given you. But the system, you have to know how the system operates. Yes, They'll be waiting on you anyway, anything you do. Oh, yes, sir. Yes. <laughs> Go ahead. Nor are the princes. Of this world. Who's the prince of this world? Satan. The devil. The darkness. We ain't walking about him. Man, we're bypassing him and whooping him. And God gave you the power to whoop his run. He have no authority over you. He have no dominion over it. Only what you let him do. And you give him permission to do. You want to get angry? Want to be cursed stupid? You give him permission to do it to you. He ain't do nothing but what you give him permission to. He have no more dominion. Amen. Thank you, Father. Only God have dominion over you. Yes, Amen. Amen. Thank His thoughts he bring to you don't have no dominion. Amen. No power unless you give it to him. Yes, Very thoughts. Yes, sir. And he bring plenty of them. Yes, sir. Keep that in mind. Ain't nothing can do that. You are the one in authority and in the power yes, of God. Yes, sir. Neither thought or nothing. Words from nobody. Listen carefully. Break it down. Listen carefully. What do you tell me? Nor of the princes of this world that come by note. No. Not. Ain't gonna be eventually. Y'all hear it? Go ahead. But we speak the wisdom of God. That, that, what is the wisdom of God? The word Come out there, everybody. What is the wisdom of God? The word of God. I had you to, to hold your hold the word, didn't I? Yes, sir. That's what we speak. That's the authority. And create a newness, a happiness, a joy, 